Iron 59 symbol is Fe. Iron 59 has 26 protons, 33 neutrons and an atomic mass of 59. It was synthetically created from Iron 58 when B ray is added then produces another neutron to become Iron 59. Its half-life is 46 days. Half-life is when the nucleus of an atom split into two parts, and half-life can only occur in an unstable isotope such as iron-59 and iodine-123. Ion-59 decays into two types of radiations, their gamma and beta radiation. Iron-59 decays because a neutron in its nucleus turns into a proton which called an antineutrino, this forces it to emit an electron and in doing that, it emits energy and radiation. Its new element after the decay process is cobalt-59 which have one proton more than ion-59. Cobalt-59 is a stable element, so, what does those radiations use for in the diagnosis of diseases? Iron-59 is used for the diagnosis of blood diseases like anemia, it is used to track the blood cells in the patient's body. As soon as it get into the patient through injection, it start to decay and gives off gamma and beta radiation, these radiations are really good for tracking blood cells. The negative aspect of iron injection are, serious hypersensitivity reactions, including anaphylactic type reactions, some of which have been life-threatening and fatal, have been reported in patients receiving injection. Patients may present with shock, clinically significant hypotension, loss of consciousness, and or collapse. Thank you for watching.